No, the thing that really kicks it off is the humble neutrino. But in a supernova, when the electrons are captured by the protons, an unbelievable number of neutrinos is released, around 10 to the 58. You would think they would just fly off at nearly the speed of light, and as a result, it traps some of those neutrinos and captures their energy. And this is what makes a star go supernova. A particle that is millions of times less massive than an electron, that barely interacts with anything, is responsible for some of the largest explosions in the universe. In that explosion, only a hundredth of 1% of the energy is released as electromagnetic radiation, the light that we can see. 